What's up guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're talking all about eyelashes, which is why I brought my girlfriend Zuleika because she knows everything to do about beauty. And you guys, she actually just started a new blog called The Daily Concealer. So if you want to know anything about beauty, makeup, even like how to eat for beauty, check it out. But today we're talking about the latest trend in the whole celeb world, which is magnetic lashes. Neither of us have tried them before, so we're gonna give it a try for our very first time and see if it actually works. We like using fake eyelashes with All the, the glue. Time. We love doing that, but today we're gonna try this magnetic lash. So basically, it's putting on these strip lashes with no glue necessary. So it's supposed to be better for even beginners. We got two different brands here. Yours are from? Mine are Ardell Professional Magnetic Lashes from Sally's Beauty Supply. And I ordered mine on Amazon Prime. They were $20 and they're um, Venus Massage. It's French. Right now, we have our makeup done. The only thing missing are lashes and we don't have mascara on. They recommend doing one coat of mascara to have a better grip on the lash. So before or after? Before. Okay, here I go. So I'm doing I'm starting with the top lash. Okay. Now I'm gonna grab the bottom one. And then basically you're having the magnets touch with your real lash in between. Like, I just don't, I mean, I'm gonna try to fix it with some tweezers. This is hard. I really don't think that this is working. And when taking them off, just be careful, you guys, because I feel like if you grip them too hard, maybe yeah. pull your natural lash. I can't get them to like, go along the end of my lashes. So I'm just gonna, you know, call up a friend, have Zuleika try to put them on for me. Hi guys, here for to the rescue. So how I do it on myself is I would sandwich them, essentially your real lash. Um, sorry, there. Okay. Oh, you got them on. Sort of. I mean, it doesn't look perfect, but I got them on. She got them on. Way better than I did. <laughs> so you actually hold them two together and then put them on? Yeah. So literally the easiest way to think about it and maybe just try this before putting them on, it's just a magnet. So they just clip on together like that. So that's exactly what you want to do to your lashes. Let's do the other eye. Open. Sort of. I mean, they're still not perfect, but they're kind of... I don't love that one. <laughs> we like one eye. They're heavy. They're definitely heavy because it's almost like you're putting two sets of eyelashes on each eye. So again, just that same sandwichy motion. We'll see if I can get it down. So I... Easier and this one actually looks like a million times better. So okay, so we got them on. They're finally kind on. Of. I mean, one of mine's a little bit lifted, and mine are just kind of all over the place. I am no scientist or doctor, but 
the thought of having magnets close to my eyes, <laughs> it kind of scares me. I like the fact that you can reuse them, but I feel like the struggle of trying to put them on and the fact that they don't even really look real, I think it's a no for me, but that's just me personally. Maybe I just need practice to, you know, get the magnets in the right spot. We had heard so much about them. We had to give them a go, but again, they aren't my favorite. I think I would much rather keep using the glue and teach you guys how to get really good at using glue. Um, we're both going to wear these throughout the day and see if they last all day, but that is actually one of my concerns is if they could like slide off. And you also, if you're going to hang on to these, you can't lose its piece that it comes with. So you can't go losing an eyelash, then you just... You don't yeah. have eyelashes, so. Right. So just looking at your lashes, I can tell they look amazing with her eyes open, but when she looks down, it's so hard to get it right along your lash line, which is what you want when putting on fake eyelashes. And that's the tricky part about making eyelashes look like they're real, real or they're yours. Um, and that was actually the hardest part besides matching the two bottom and top magnet together is um, getting them as close to your lash line as you can because they need to grip onto something. So we'll show you guys what they look like when we look down. down. It's a little scary. <laughs> Not the best look, but we'll show you guys. That just makes perfect. <laughs> You know, I, the reason why I was really excited to try these magnetic lashes is because I like the concept. You could literally keep these lashes, you could keep this little thing in your purse, and if you decide you want lashes, I don't know, to grab a cocktail with a girlfriend, you could just sit there in your car and yeah. put them on. I think you're done with work, yeah, you're you, in your car, you need a night look, bam. So I think I'm actually really going to try to practice and get the magnetic sandwich down so that I can just keep them. It definitely could just be a practice thing. Right. It's like when we, with the first time we put on fake eyelashes with glue, I'm sure they didn't look that good. Yeah, I mean, nobody's good at anything the first time they try it. Everything, especially with makeup, just takes practice and repetitive, and right. the more you do it, the better you'll be. So I'm not gonna poo-poo magnetic lashes right away. I'm gonna give it a few more tries. But I'm happy that we tested them out. Thanks for watching, guys, and follow me on Daily Concealer. Yes, make sure to check her out. Her stuff is incredible. And I will see all of you guys in the next video. Thank you, Jess. Thanks for joining me. We can bat our lashes. <laughs>